Hello again, it's Nick right here. And this morning I had to do something that I really did not want to do. And I did not go for my run. And it sucks. It's the first time since I started running that I've ever not run when I wanted to run. And I'll tell you why. You remember Monday when I said this? I didn't want to do it. Well, sometimes when in you're feeling like you don't want to do something, it's it's your body telling you that you shouldn't do it. <laughs> and I started that Freelex Freeletics app. I started I, I I dove in on Sunday and Monday I was really not feeling like it, but I made the commitment, I'm going to do another one on Monday. And so I did another one. Well, Tuesday, I was pretty darn miserable. I was so, so sore. And I thought, oh man, I pulled something uh, in my calf, on my right leg, above my ankle. And it, I was miserable. I was really miserable. By the end of the day, I was feeling a little better. And I thought, oh gosh, I really, I, I really want to do this run tomorrow, which is today. And it was a hard run. It was, you know, two minutes intervals at 5K pace. It was a hard run. And I, I, I need to do this. I got to do it. I got to run. I got to run. But when I woke up this morning, I was still really, really stiff and really pretty sore. And I thought, dang it, I pushed myself pretty hard. Sunday and Monday, I do not want to screw something up and end up really injured and not be able to run my 10K next month. So I said, I'm going to take it easy. That's, I'm taking it easy. Now tomorrow, it's supposed to be a 40 minute recovery run. My wife is on the C25K program. She's on her 20 minute run, I think tomorrow. I think we're just going to do her easy 20 minute run tomorrow and see how that goes. Just real easy, real, real slow. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully I can get back into that because I got to, I got to keep running. I just got to keep running. So, anyhow, I hope y'all are well. We'll see you next time. Bye.